Well, it's another beautiful day. It's a Friday, it's about midday, full tide as you can see, there's no current at the moment. Um, gonna head out do an overnight trip, gonna shoot out shortly, do my usual, uh, get a fish for dinner to make a curry out of. And I think we've got around about uh, five degrees tonight, so it's gonna be pretty cold, um, but that should be okay. Get a nice hot curry going and uh, that'll keep me nice and warm. Get tucked up thing. I do some early morning soft baiting in the shallows uh, around sort of North Waiheke. Gonna try a few different bays, a few different spots. And I've got some different coloured lures as well, so uh, that's what we're up to. Um, shouldn't be much breeze, it's around about 10 knots at the moment, but I believe it's dropping off down to 5, so should be good. Okay, we'll see you out there shortly. Thank you. 
cold night tonight there's no doubt about that they're saying it's going to be two degrees in Auckland uh, with a small light frost in you know areas that are in the shade uh, in the morning and um, but out here shouldn't be too bad here the water temperature has dropped a degree since I was last here so um, it will be a bit cooler tonight but I'm rugged up got my good gear got uh, a uh, what do you call it a down I think it's called a duck down blanket which is really super warm and I've got my sheepskin to sleep on, um, but uh, so it should be a pretty good night. So I've got a couple of good fish there in the bin, and in the morning I'm going to sneak out behind me and do my sort of shallow water stuff uh, further up here in the, the headland there. So. Um, for those of you who are following my little cooking recipe, here's an addition for you. Uh, what we've got now is raisins I don't know why I didn't think of this before and I love raisins and they go really well with the, with the curry they sort of sweeten everything up a bit right that's the finished that's the finished one now that's all good now the um I'll just turn that off I just had a taste the raisins really lifted um, very very sweet so um, that's a delicious new element into the dish uh, so I'm uh, just going to have a little go at this now. Oh my god, this stuff is just so good. Mm. Oh, the old raisins, I really lift it. Mm. Out of this world. Well. I'm going to uh, uh, probably, well not turn in, but uh, go and do uh, a little bit of work. Uh, I think the sun has probably got another sort of five minutes before it goes. Uh, it'll be pitch black. We've got a little bit of a, actually got a, quite a good moon tonight. That's the old moon there. Um, so it's about half moon. So that should give us quite a bit of light, which is good. And... Uh, yeah, it's beautiful now. The wind's dropped right off. The birds are tweeting. Everyone's happy. I can smell some pretty lovely garlicky smells wafting down from the Aini Roa restaurants up here. But uh, I bet it's not as nice as my curry. <laughs> right, see you in the morning. Good morning from Aini Roa. Uh, beautiful night here. It's been so peaceful um sun's just on its way up so i'm gonna sneak out to a new spot um where i haven't really fished here before but uh it is in the bruce duncan book and uh he's had some luck over winter mainly stray lying big baits after laying a trail of burley so we <laughs> don't have that here but um oh yeah she's a bit dark there but yeah we'll get fired up and yeah get underway Right lure, try the old gulp. Uh, I don't know what these ones are called actually. They're crazy leg pink. A bit of fish. This is what we're here for. Yep. Here's a good snap. There 
Yeah, this is a good step. Just don't want to lose and it's very shallow here. Well then, about five meters now. Oh, he's gone into the reef. Damn. Yeah, he's in the reef. Big fish this one, he's going right in behind the reef, so I'm in a bit of trouble. I'm just gonna keep him on because once I go on the other side of the reef I should be able to pull him out, but uh, his head is basically behind a rock. Oh, oh, oh bugger, he just came he just <laughs> he just came out and then as soon as I Applied the pressure, he's gone back again. Oh man, that was a good fish. And he spat it. He spat it. Yeah. This feels like a half decent fish too, so that was on the drop. Yeah, this is a good fish. Right, we'll tighten up, we're not gonna get caught again. And that was about halfway down, floating down, and he grabbed it. That's oh, not a very big one. Be a good keeper. Be a good eating fish. Probably around about 40, I think. Yeah, about 40. Oops. Alright, this is when you need to be a bit better organised. Okay, yeah, he's about 40. Nice fish. There we go. Nice, good quality, beautiful, only rower snapper. So we'll let him go now, he can live to fight another day. So I've got some nice fish there, uh, that one's quite nice, that one's about 44, um, there's a few under there as well, but uh, good kelpie fish, these are beautiful winter, fat winter snapper, beautiful eating. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to chuck it in now and uh, go home. Um, but, got some nice fish. It's just awesome to do the shallow water fishing in the winter time. Great night at Only Roa. Really enjoyed staying there. Been such a stunning day today. Absolutely beautiful. Um, but the uh, weather's not going to hold. Yeah, mind, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, 